I'm with head coach John Trummel after the Trojans' third practice of the week before the Cure Bowl on Friday. Coach, how was this practice different from the previous two? Yeah, today's our walkthrough day. We're on a normal schedule, so it's really like our Thursday practice um, of the game week. Is even though it's Wednesday, we play on Friday, so like our Thursday practice, which is a, really a walkthrough, detailed day, a lot of communication, and then tomorrow we'll have our run through uh, before we play the game on Friday. Um, just kind of polishing everything before we get ready for game time. How is that important, a practice like this, to have before a game compared to the other two practices that you've had already? Yeah, it's a heavy mental day. It's a, a little bit of a um, decel day on your body, especially our guys not only had practice yesterday, but they spent a lot of times at Universal on their feet. Some of those guys, I looked at their watches, and they had like six miles on their watch or something from walking around. So really to get their legs back underneath them, to make sure we're fresh for the game, and then just making sure we're clean on all of our alignment assignment things. At the end of practice, you talked about being in game mode. What does game mode mean? What did you tell the players, um, especially with two days as we get closer to the bowl game? Yeah, we've given them a lot of free time uh, the last couple of days because I want them to enjoy earning the opportunity to be at a bowl game and be here in Orlando and experience the things that, um, you, that this place provides and the bowl game provides you with. So a lot of free time in the last two days outside of our practice. Um, and then after that, <laughs> after that, yeah, after that, um, we're 48 hours basically from the game now. And so I always remind them on Thursdays of a normal game week, which today is. We're really in game mode, and today's a recovery day. Get off your feet, hydrate, eat, sleep, and then um, tomorrow is our, our day before the game activities. I'm here with O'Shea Fletcher after the Trojans' third practice of the week. O'Shea, how was it out there? How has the experience been so far for you? Um, it's been a great experience, especially after not being here the last three years as a team. I think everyone is enjoying it. We're also um, locking in for practice and handling business when it's time. But overall, Orlando has been a great experience and fun with this team. You've been here, you were here in 2018 with the Trojans, last bowl game. What's the difference been like for you now as an integral part of the defense? Mm -hmm. so now my role has changed a lot. So preparing for this game and also making sure the team also know that we're here to win has been a very important role for me. Just making sure that we also are um, staying focused, but also at the same time enjoying the opportunity that we have. Has there been a favorite part of the trip so far? My favorite part has been riding the, um, the Raptor at Universal. Thanks, OJ. Thank you. I'm here with wide receiver Rajay Johnson after the Trojans' third practice of the week before the Cure Bowl. Rajay, what's been practice like for you and the other wide receivers? Um, Pretty much, like, we've been having a good practice, you know, and, like, like you said, it's the third day, just keeping the guys dialed in and just, you know what I'm saying, keeping the task at hand. So we got a big game ahead of us and trying to get 12 wins on the season. So that's a good thing, trying to remain ranked. You've been to a bowl game before. This is the first bowl game you've been to with Troy. Is there a message you've given to the other players? What was that experience like and what is this experience like? Um, Pretty much, you know, guys, like, they're thinking about the gifts and stuff. You know, you know the game is not about the gifts, you know. Being in previous bowl games, telling them guys, like, it's, it's no other game, but it's the most important game because it's the last time you suit up with this team. So just cherish this moment to take everything in. And you'll remember it if you win, but if you lose, it might hurt in your stomach. UTA provides a unique defense. What have you been uh, and the other wide receivers working on to exploit that and looking forward to in the game? Um, it's kind of like for me, like, it's kind of this year just to reflect, you know, the guys coming in for Conference USA and then like us playing a Conference USA team in the bowl game, like I've seen these guys for the last two years. So they're not doing anything no difference. And, you know, it's not the, that they're not, they got any good guys on their side. Like they got great athletes on their side, but like we just take our preparation and focus on ourselves. You know, if we get ourselves together, we should have a good game plan. Thanks, Roger. Thank you.